Summer is historically a slow selling season as many of us head off on a break and enjoy the holidays. Since the pandemic, however, the selling seasons have been scrambled. And last year, we saw record numbers of properties selling over that time period. So this summer, if you're looking to sell, what are some of the things that you should consider? The first is that there are fewer properties for sale over summer, which does create greater competition. Although we are heading into a particularly strong December and January time period, there are fewer properties for sale when we compare to spring. With fewer properties for sale, that means greater competition, and you may achieve a better price selling over summer. The second thing to consider is that although prices aren't falling, they are starting to slow. Since the start of the pandemic, Australian house prices have increased by 25%. Over the next two years, it is unlikely we will continue to see the same rates of growth. At this stage, it certainly doesn't look like prices are about to fall, but the market does seem to be slowing. The third thing to consider is that restrictions to finance have begun and we are likely to continue to see additional restrictions in the new year. There are two things that could substantially slow the property market. The first are very heavy restrictions on finance and the second is an interest rate rise. At this stage, an interest rate rise is looking unlikely in 2022. However, we may see restrictions to finance escalate, particularly if lending doesn't calm down. And finally, some homes are just more desirable over summer. If you live near the beach, you have a great pool, or perhaps your garden looks better in summer, it may be better to sell, and you may achieve a better price selling December to February. We're proud to present real-time data to help you on your property journey. To read more about the market, head to raywhite.com and download Ray White Now.